what's good, y'all? This for all the kids that have parents that will probably never really be able to understand the realm that has opened up to you. It's fine. You know what I'm saying? It's fine. Uh, this is what my community is for. This is for the, the kids. I mean, kids, teenagers, like, young adults. This is what my realm is for. This is your outlet. You get what I'm saying? Um, it's not even saying my realm. It's just that I see that, uh, I wouldn't say indigo kids. I would say more like crystal or rainbow kids. They have a more pure vibration to want to save their own face in the spiritual realm. So what that means is that they have their own, they, they will make sure when it comes to what, when it comes to like holding face in the spiritual realm, they're going to make sure that the spiritual realm sees that they're doing good because they're always in the spiritual realm <coughs> at all times. I'm talking for people that wake up and see the light. Before they go to sleep, they see the light. You know what I'm saying? Uh, they see their realm before they even open their eyes. You get what I mean? Like, like y'all just have to get the flow that I'm talking about. What the hell is that on? Uh, that's on my phone. <laughs> but, um, so yeah, it's like, um, cause I was just sitting here thinking like, Man, I probably will have to accept the fact that I probably will never get to my mom. Like, she get what I'm saying, but how can you explain something to somebody that, that haven't put in the time to learn the knowledge and haven't really seen it with their eyes? You get what I'm saying? And uh, and not even explaining it. I'm talking, telling y'all, like, after years and years and years of trying to express myself saying the same thing, mom's, you know, it's not even like she don't get it. But it is like because she don't get it because, you know, you know certain people when they get some, they get it, but it's like, it's... It's a day and time anyway that she can't process that when it comes to her. You know what I'm saying? Like, she has to goddamn focus on her own life. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's kind of just how it is. But, you know, and that's with everybody. It's a good thing. You get what I'm saying? Because that's what I'm even making this video to say. Y'all have to, we have to... Focus on our own life. Not saying in the sense to forget about people. But, like, you have to know what you know is what you know. When somebody show you they self, you have to believe it. And you have to be selfish. I hate to say this, but it's true. Like, even put it like this. Give people strikes. You know what I'm saying? Give people opportunities. You know what I'm saying? Um, you know, and... Also, we have to start, and I'm talking about for people that's in your family type shit, or like, you know, people you already know, but for people, new people that you're meeting, you have to start praying like this, that I am connected to the people that I want to connect to. Um, we are being prepared for our meeting together. Um, thank you in advance, ancestors, for preparing me for us to meet. Thank you, uh, Spiritual Round, for preparing them for us to meet. You get what I'm saying? Like, different things. You add and take in what you want. And you could talk for as long as you want. You could talk until you meet these people. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can literally tarry about this situation. Um, and, but my point was, because my point was, because that's, that's beside the point. Because if you're praying, you're going to obviously have your discernment on that's what my point was, getting to a point where you have your discernment on, like, at all times and being bold enough to be like, nah. See, that's the problem with us, 
And I will say problem. I will say problem. It's a very big problem. It's a very big contradiction, and it's a matrix. It's a portal that we're going to have to break, a curse, a system that we're going to have to break off our lives. You don't need acceptance. You know what I'm saying? Um, you don't need acceptance. Like, and I kind of feel sorry for people that are like, that don't have family because it's like, The per people that do have family, we always know that we are really accepted. It's probably just not in the way we want to. I can't imagine how a person that's really out here by themselves. And that's my, like, honest opinion, y'all. Like, we go through a lot of shit because it's kind of like, eh, we spoiled. But, you know, but even with us being spoiled, it, opened up, it opens us up to just working miracles. You know what I'm saying? Because that's how I feel. Like, I found out that I wasn't being treated like I was supposed to be treated. Come to find out, it wasn't my mom's fault. It was the system's fault. Come to find out, it's not my dad's fault. It's the system's fault. It's, yo, like, even when you realize that motherfucking slavery was real. You know what I'm saying? Like, when you... <laughs> I'm talking about, like, when you're from a kid, probably going into, like, teenager. You know what I'm saying? Like, when you realize, like, what that really means. You get what I mean? Like, what that really means. I probably didn't get it. I ain't going to say when because I can't really depict it. It wasn't. Uh, but, oh, I do remember. I was, like, 21. They brought the, is that? Well, I can't say that neither. It had to be some movie that I watched that made me realize, like, that traumatized the fuck out of me. Like, you can't. <laughs> like, this whole system was really the reason why a lot of us had to just pop up and spring up to heal our people. You know what I'm saying? This, this is not just... This is not just like, man, y'all. This is not just like... A spiritual movement going on. It's a history movement. Like something so big is about to crack. But I also want y'all to realize these couple facts. A lot of shit has cracked. Like a lot of shit has. Like music is moving differently. Um, um, the business of music is moving different. The consciousness of our people is moving differently. Um. Most people uh, watch some of the stuff that happened with Nipsey, uh, you know, in the industry, period, and they get it. If they don't get it, they have a numbsh. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? So, like, I think that's what we should stay as a leader spiritually. Well, the people that want to continue to be spiritual leaders, you know, some spiritual leaders get caught up and then they want to drop the word leader. Like... But, you know, spiritually, like, it's, it's, we got to start remembering, like, this thing bigger than us. We got support. Like, we got support. You know, we can't see it yet. Even though the spiritual realm may think we, we not, we, we not ready to see certain things or understand certain, you have to, have to, have to get comfortable with being patient. You have to get comfortable with nothing. Nothing. Going outside going outside one day and doing absolutely nothing. Just sitting there. Talking to yourself. Get thirsty, don't get up. Just sitting there. If you get thirsty, you stop talking. And then eventually your mouth will get back water. You know what I'm saying? Like those are the type of fads that like we have to go through to like understand that we are alone and it's okay like we not dying the things that we went through are just mental once we reprogram our mind we realize that okay now that I understand all the perspectives nobody really did anything to me I'm healed I am helped I am out here for a bigger purpose the ancestors is, is doing a lot of stuff right now, y'all. Like, it's 
very rare you can go somewhere and not hear a conversation about something um, spiritual. Honestly, even if they don't know, it's, it's, you know, it sounds like a lot of complaining, but that's, <laughs> that's the first step. You know what I'm saying? Like, if you go out and about these days, it just sounds like a bunch of people complaining. Like, motherfucker just complaining all the goddamn time. But that's the first step. That's the first step, cause it takes the other motherfuckers in the in the vibes to like, to help them out, have that conversation. Like, like it's like walking with the person that's like complaining about it being hot, and you've been waiting for the sun to come out. You know what I'm saying? It's been raining for two days, and you've been waiting for the sun to come out. You, but you know, you walking with a person. That's like, and it's hot as hell. And you know you can't say nothing. You know, you, you know, like, a lot of people I, I, I love or 